You know, it's definitely an exciting day when I get to sample the latest technology that's out there. I've driven a, a Chevy Tahoe. Uh, this is my third one, and I love it. It's great. Kind of a bummer that it only gets 10 miles a gallon where I live. And to think that, like, I'm going to get a chance to drive a fuel cell vehicle that um, uses hydrogen to power an electric motor and uh, propel me is going to be uh, an incredible day. I'm going to feel a little bit like George Jetson right now. And, so what uh, about the emissions? I heard that it's not got too much coming out of it other than water? Well, yeah. yeah. Uh, it, it's hydrogen. And the hydrogen powers an electric motor. Gotcha. And that propels the car. And the only emissions from that is like a water vapor. And it's like I came back here once and I held a, uh, my eyeglasses to it just to see if I could fog them up. And, and there wasn't much going on. So it's really zero emissions. Yeah, let me jump in on the other side. Oh, all right. hey, not before dinner and a movie, buddy. <laughs> Okay, so this little water drop right here, this represents uh, water vapor. Uh, this is GM's uh, logo for the new fuel stack, uh, fuel cell vehicles. It's awesome. I think I'm going to put it on right now. So you know a lot about the car. How did you get interested in Project Driveway? How'd you hear about it? Um, you know, I have a neighbor who drove one of these cars by him, and I flagged him down, and he told me all about the program, told me who to get in touch with and she offered me an opportunity to drive the car, so I couldn't really say no to that. Hello! Very cool. Do you have anything you t you're trying to convince any of your Facebook fans? I mean, trying to tell them about what you're doing or no, trying to just, let them know? You know what? I've been trying to let them know that this is... Uh, I had pictures on my Facebook page of, yeah. of this car, and, uh, you know, it's just astonishing to me that this, t that this technology exists. Mm -hmm. You know this car in and out already. Well, yeah, you yeah. know, I, I'm not trying to tinker, but yeah. just a couple <laughs> But look, you know, the gauge size of these wires, mm -hmm. it, uh, it handles so much electricity, it's enough kilowatts to run 12 houses, which is pretty astonishing to think that the energy that it takes to light up and keep refrigerators going in 12 houses, um, this car can produce all with a small little fuel stack. Do you, do you think it still has the torque and pickup? Oh that my you god, know? it's ridiculous. Here, look, this depicts the hydrogen coming up to the fuel stack, yeah. making electricity here, storing it either in the yellow batteries, or here's the, uh, the motor, the electrical motor that turns the wheels. And then these little blue drops uh, depict the emission, which is water, and it comes out in vapor in the back. Very cool. I don't know that anyone yeah. in the uh, test parking lot <laughs> actually <laughs> broke the wheels loose, but uh, got to be the first sometime. There's a first for everything, yeah, right? It's the car. Yeah, this can move. Well, here. here. They're not very happy. <laughs> breaking the law, breaking the law. They're out of the way. So just... Yeah. I mean, I the mean, wheels chirp. The car, I mean, the car takes off. It does. Um, You know, it's got plenty of power.